गुड मॉर्निंग एवरी वन वेलकम टू माई यूट्यूब चैनल लीव क्लासेस आई एम अंजली टूडे आई एम नॉट गोइंग टू टीच यू एनी थिंग न्यू आई विल बी जस्ट क्लियरिंग द डाउट्स ऑफ मेनी स्टूडेंट्स दो कमेंटेड एंड इवन आई गॉट द मेल्स रिगार्डिंग दिस सो वी आर टेकिंग द टॉपिक स्ट्रिक्स टूडे फॉर द डाउट्स यू मे आस्क योर डाउट्स एंड लाइक दिस ओनली आई विल बी टेकिंग अप ऑल द डाउट्स ऑफ वन टॉपिक एंड रिलीजिंग अ वीडियो फॉर दैट ओके so you may give your doubts in the comment section now the first doubt which i am taking today is from the quiz this quiz is available on the channel the link also today i'll give in the description box of today's video you may download and still this quiz is on for attempting this is the very common question from many children i got that Ma'am, the answer is not correct, or how to solve it? Today also I got two mails regarding this, so I thought of clearing your doubt. So first we begin with this question that is from the quiz. The question is that you have to give the output quiz. Four options were there, and these two statements are there. String s equals to leave classes quiz, right? System dot out dot print ln s dot caret of s dot two upper case dot length minus two. So I want you to write the output before seeing this video further. Pause it here and then do it and then again you start the video and check. So let us do it. First, I told you always whenever we do string programs. you put the index number so it is 0 1 2 3 4 5 6 7 8 9 10 11 12 13 14 15 16 so the length of this string is 17 the index numbers are from 0 to 16 so let us solve it so here we will be writing s dot caret of first always the inner bracket is solved and here we'll doing we are doing the same thing s dot two upper case s is this string two upper case of this will be l e a f classes quiz this is converted into upper case dot length i am doing step by step so that it will be more clear to you to understand now here again s dot caret of leave classes quiz dot length the length of this is 17 so this will result in 17 minus 2 so it is S dot caret of fifteen, and at from S string caret of fifteen is I. So this is the right option. So here option A is the correct answer. Many children got confused because of this two upper case. They were saying that the answer should be capital I. No. here nothing the string is not converted and stored it is just converted and you are finding the length so length whether in small or in capital length will remain same so like this we will be solving that and the answer will be small i you may check this on java compiler also okay so let's start with the next doubt the next doubt which i have taken is single quotes space and double quotes space the space between single quotes and double quotes children are confused that when to use the space within single quotes or when to use the space within double quotes children whenever we are using a space within single quotes it is a character value in char data type we can store that so you can take char ch equals to space right this is correct statement but you cannot write char ch equals to within double quotes this is wrong 
This is a space within double quotes is a string constant that we cannot store in a CAD data type, right? And now a uh, single quotes space or within double quotes space generally we use in Java string programming. So uh, we have to add a space in the beginning or at the end of the given string. So there sometimes we use the space within double quotes or sometimes we may use in single quotes also. Both are correct in that case. In string if you are writing in string s equals to suppose you have taken a, b, c you want to add a space in the beginning of this string. I can write s equals to space plus s. So this will be space and a, b, c when you will check the string s will become this space and abc or i can do double quotes plus s this is also correct space plus abc so here both are correct when you are using a string variable you can add a char also to that or add a string also to that so the string constant cannot be added to character constant or char variable but in string we can add character also or we can add string also. So I hope the difference between the space within single quotes and the space within double quotes is clear. You can add a char value with string value but you cannot add a string value with a char value right. So let's move on to the next doubt of the students. The next point which I am taking is the confusion between length and index numbers in string. Suppose I have taken string s equals to computer and the question is you have to display the length of this right. So normally I say that whenever you are using any string value give the index number. So index number in string is from 0 to 7 in this case. But it has nothing to do with the length of the string. Length means total number of characters present in the given string. It can be space, it can be digit. It can be any special symbol. So length will give you total number of characters of the given string. So here if I find the length, length will be 8. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8. Length will be 8. And sometimes children say, they say that last index number is 7. Why length is 8? Index number always starts from 0 and the last index number of any string is size minus 1 or the length minus 1. Like in this case also if length is 8, the index numbers are starting from 0 to 7. But length and index number please don't get confused. These totally two different things are there. Index number tells you the position starting from 0 till last. Starting from 0 in increasing order it goes. And length means total number of characters present in the string. Right? So don't get confused with these small things. And in case of any doubt, any problem, please comment in the comment section. I will try to clear your doubts. My best wishes are with you. Those who have not subscribed the channel, please do subscribe and press the bell icon so that you get notifications for all the videos and no important topic is missed by you. Keep practicing, keep doing the program, keep solving. God bless you children.